So I am standing outside of Oakland Cemetery in Atlanta, Georgia. It's right behind me. Uh, I work uh, right now at the place that's right across the street from here. So sometimes I come out here to take walks, try to get out a little bit. Uh, got the Atlanta skyline in the back right over there. So um, yeah, let's go inside and take a look. favorite thing about walking through here is uh, you see something new every time and a while ago I found this guy right up here um, I don't know who he is uh, I can find out his name probably pretty easy but he's got a statue of himself right up there it's not creepy at all all right Jasper Smith born in Walton County uh, died December 29th uh, looks like 1833 there he is. So there are some uh, people of note that are buried here. Uh, there's three to my knowledge. Um, one is only probably known around Atlanta. Um, Maynard Jackson. He's the first African-American mayor of Atlanta. And let's see if I can find where he's at. Jackson. Right in 2003. And it looks like they've decorated. Alright, next, uh, probably, probably the most famous person in here. It's tied between this one and the next one. Depends on, you know, who you think is more famous than the other. Um, we'll go see the first one since it's closest right here. But it's uh, Margaret Mitchell, the author of Gone with the Wind, which was turned into a movie. All right, so Margaret Mitchell's right here. Uh, you can actually see it on the back side. There we go. Margaret Mitchell Marsh. That's her. Died in Atlanta, Georgia, August. 1949 so yeah and her house uh, I think it burned down they reconstructed it but it's over on let's see Peachtree and either 14th or 10th I can't remember but yeah that's where that is and on to the next person um, we got golf legend Bobby Jones so uh, Let's go see, let's go see Bobby. All right, time out. I love it when I see creepy stuff like this. Uh, so this has been broken. And you can see, uh, all the way inside this thing. So that's terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. Uh, one died in 1900 and one died in 1908. always a ton of golf balls out here they clean them up fairly often but people just keep bringing them and dropping them back off but yeah uh, died 1975 no wait that's his wife 1971 
I'm sorry, I can't read uh, public school. But yeah, um, I'm probably gonna end up doing a two-parter of this because maybe three. I know, I find a lot of cool things in here each time I go through it, and so I can't do it all in one video because it would take too long. But yeah, uh, I'll definitely do two parts. There's, there's a lot of stuff in here. So look out for that.